Good morning and afternoon to you all. I'm your host, Marie France, and in this channel, I help you to leave your I and that girl era. So if you're interested, stay tuned and subscribe. In today's episode, we'll be talking about thinking like a million bucks. Ladies, you have to understand that everything starts in your mind and consider your mind your bank, your safe zone. And every time you want to jump to a new trend, just think of inflation. And ladies, what does inflation do? Inflation steals your wealth. So invest properly. Think properly. So what I'm trying to say is that the moment that you're focusing on one negative part, it's actually inflation. It's draining your energy. It's finishing your energy and you end up being your energy ends up being soaked out of you and you you just so drained and you just so tired and all that and you don't know what to do with your life that's why it's inflation you it's bad it's a bad investment you did a bad investment with your energy with your time that's what it's called and we don't want to do that in my channel we don't do that what we're focusing on is the good part is the good affirmation if and if you all want me to have a video of speaking about affirmation and all that yep. yes and you know positive affirmation they actually help you to um, stay focused on your goals and all that you can actually make your own positive affirmations too if you guys want me to make a video on how to do that you could always tell me in the comment section and I will get right to it so next to so to the next topic we have Oh, this is a good one. Think rich, look rich. So the first thing I, I know that we all think when I say um, think like a million bucks is look like a million bucks because, yeah, <laughs> that's what everyone does. Everyone looks rich and, you know, even those that are not rich, they look rich. And that's what I'm saying. Think rich, look rich. You have to look rich. So I'm not saying go wearing all those gucci tops with the you know the brand name on it i'm not saying do, do that no don't do that it's not elegant it's not classy I, at least i don't think it's not that's my unpopular opinion and yes go for timeless pieces go for um beige go for beige colors good colors red good um pastel white Good colors and and when i'm saying think rich look rich i'm not talking about um looking rich in the sense of you know it looks good and we're gonna go with it no there are actually some rules that apply to looking rich you can't just show up to an event or you know a a ball and wear a tote bag it doesn't go like that even though it looked good you can't just mix stuff up you actually have to go with the rules and if you guys want a video about that i could surely make so the next one is learn to socialize look for long lasting friends so you should have friends that can get you some way don't have friends that you just want to have day to go to the club go and do all that going shopping it's all good I guess, <laughs> but then you, sh you shouldn't be aiming for those type of friends and for the type of friends that have a long lasting, um, they have a long way to go. Like they know what they want to become. I know that there's a lot of people who are still figuring it out, but then if they have like, they, they know that, hey, I'm going to become something, then those are the type of friends that you, you strive to be, you, you like strive to be, to, 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 um, to be with the people that motivate you to become something better right not just someone who says that you'll be like hey i want to be i want to do this and then they're like yeah like we could do it and all that and then the next day they're just gonna be like man i have plans they might have plans but at the same time if it's a constant thing of they're not showing up then those are not the type of friends that you should actually be striving for instead you should go for the people that have something 
going on for them already some some people even the ones that already have something going on for them like literally have something going on for them and then you just show up and you're like i'm gonna do this and then you see them doing that and they motivate you or you doing something and you motivate them that's a good friendship over there so moving on to um good manners yes good manners is the key you should know how you you should know all the etiquette when eating when walking when dressing and doing your hair and all that ladies you can't go wrong especially when you're going to hide lost places you cannot go wrong because trust me in an instant they will tell you off they will they, those people know how to read people so you can't go to these places and and think you're just gonna show up there doing whatever you think you're gonna do no so have good mon good manners when you go up there learn to say your your um good morning you i don't know if it's the afternoon good afternoon and all that learn to greet uh, learn to be kind you know have have that you know the feminine thing going on for you like just carry yourself with elegance and class and just be soft i'm not being i'm not saying being being soft like in in a way that they might like you know say something to you that is just unpleasant and you let it go no ex you should learn to like respond with like you know with respect to even though someone disrespects you it doesn't mean that you should disrespect them back you just have a nice nasty thing going on for you that's what i do i have a nice nasty thing going on for me and i think that will help you too and if you guys want to figure out that you could always tell me in the comment section and then on to the next one we have the hobby so a few things that i have been practicing is um writing i've been practicing how to write um doing some pilates and and uh, I've been learning how to speak um, Korean and all that. So I'm saying that um, you should find something that it's making you it's making you a better person. Something that you know that I could like if things were to go wrong, I have something else. You know, I have something else going on for me. I'm good at something else going on for me. Mastered at something. It can be anything. A hobby it can be anything right and ladies last but not least have a good sleep one thing that helps me sleep better is um what i've realized sleeping better is actually playing some jazz i don't know why but these days i just it just feels so good like when i listen to jazz songs and it's so comfort it's so com comforting sorry my bad so comforting and it's just so relaxing that i just get to be in a mood of you know maybe you wanted to show up in a um you wanted to show up in a like luxury thing and one of the best ways to actually become or set your and like get yourself there is to like hear what those people hear do what those people do and just like you could go to the lounge and all that and what will you, will you be listening to all this hip-hop and all that no you will be listening to songs that don't have lyrics literally and it's it's like that nice like and you have to get used to that like sleeping and waking up and you're like oh i love this and then you might even go to wherever you want to go and then you want and then they might even play one one person you're gonna be like oh is this that and then you you build a connection and that's a very good thing and you should just you know um learn to um, embrace yourself and all that learn to have a good night's sleep eight hours best and you know like just live your best life that's what i'm going to say and i love you guys and if you guys have any more questions, any videos that you guys want me to make, you can always leave it in the comment section. I'll be sure to check it out or respond to you guys. And have a great time, great day.